also appreciate the government of the day. The government of the day has broken a jinx that all of us have been yearning for. We are happy with the government for even for the first time, for the first time in the history of our nationhood that we have a representation at the Federal Executive Council. That alone is something that we must all clap for this government and wish them well and continue to pray for this administration because somebody that gives us little, I'm sure he will be ready to give you the bigger one. For all since 1999, we have been uh, agitating, we were praying, but God have answered our prayer. And then finally, we want to urge, we being the original inhabitants, let us be accommodative as usual to other Nigerians. And let us also support the government of the day, especially the FCT administration. Wherever the government brings any policy, we should support the policy. So that the aim and objective of policy is being achieved. And then let us also cherish our culture, our tradition, norms and values, so that we don't allow other Nigerians to destroy or disturb our, uh, our own heritage. Well, this, uh, this event is a wonderful event. Uh, we joined the world to celebrate the World Indigenous Day today here in Nigeria, in FCT, the uh, capital, federal, uh, federal capital territory. Uh, as you can see, we have some of nine indigenous tribes here who are here. They are celebrating, everybody is rejoicing, flying this culture, showing this cultural uh, attires in order for the culture not to perish. We have uh, uh, our cultural attires here. We also have participants, participants who are here. They are also here to revamp their culture. You can see how we have different masquerade. You can see some masquerade from even my dad, uh, Basa. You can see how they are flying. You can see how they are entertaining people. So this day is a remarkable day that uh, we always celebrate. We join the world to celebrate. Well, uh, first and foremost, uh, uh, the indigenous people of FCT are suffering from political marginalization. And uh, we are grateful to have uh, uh, the president, President Ahmed Bola Tunibu. We must recommend him for an effort for nominating the indigenous, uh, the FCT native as a minister. So as you can see gradually, we are actually filling up the gap politically. But there's still a lot of work to be done here in FCT. FCT needs to be treated like a state. FCT needs to have enjoyed the way Lagos, and when Lagos was a federal, uh, uh, federal capital, they enjoyed there is a state in Lagos and also there's a federal capital. So the FCT fight now, the FCT indigenous people are yearning for mayorship. So we need to have a mayor, we need to be treated like a state, we need to, the, our territories need to be expanded. Like all the states, they have like three senatorial uh, 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 districts and the FCT is only having one, just one. And we have the landmark. Ekiti State, I, I so believe Ekiti State is no more than FCT.